Scientists in Egypt say they've discovered the fossilized remains of an amphibious, amphibious four-legged whale. Excuse me. The bones were found in rock formations that are 43 million years old. It's thought they could help trace the transition of whales from land to sea. The BBC's Tim Allman has the details. They are some of the most impressive and majestic animals on Earth. Giants of the ocean, we know they are most definitely not fish. And up till now, we knew they didn't normally have legs. But then in the western deserts of Egypt, these bones were unearthed. The discovery is of a new species of an amphibious whale that could both swim and walk on land. We named it after the ancient Egyptian god Anubis for his deadly bite and strong jaw. This is what Phaeomycetes anubis may have looked like some 40 odd million years ago. It's estimated to have been around three meters long and would have weighed somewhere in the region of 600 kilos. And it may be a sort of missing link as whales evolved, moving from the land to the oceans. The question here is, can we find skeletons of other whales? Whales are considered one of the creatures that developed the most in their evolution because they evolved from living on land to living in the sea. The hunt is now on for more bones, more fossils, a chance to discover the secret of whales that could walk. Tim Ullman, BBC News.